You're watching Swipe. Here's a little taste of what we've got for you on this week's show. <gasps> what? I get a surprise from a tech magician. Stay with us because still to come, I'll introduce you to one of the first magicians to specialize in manipulating technology. And there's a trick in store for us. I, I just want to show you this new iPad. Apple just sent it to us. Now, when I say magician, what's the first thing that comes to mind? I bet it's not a smartphone, but some magicians these days are going digital, like Tom London, who's been a contestant on America's Got Talent. I met up with him and I began by asking what it means to be a tech magician. Have you seen these iPad Pros? There's this really cool new feature Apple just announced the other day. You can just grab things like this. If you give them a wiggle and slide them out, isn't that crazy? For me, it's about that classic Arthur C. Clarke quote. You know, any sufficiently advanced technology is indistinguishable from magic. So I find there's this magic in technology, advanced technology. It's something uh, impossible can be achieved with, with tech. And how did you end up as a tech magician? I'm a, a programmer and a, like a coder, so my background's always been tech, it's always been gadgets. So I would, I would see a magic trick, um, I'd see someone perform some magic, or maybe a, an illusion, and, and immediately my mind would work, it would think, how could I do all of that using technology? One of the biggest complaints people have about technology is yeah. when it fails on them. If it fails for you, it ruins the trick. How do you cope? It happens all the time. It really does. <laughs> so, I mean, I've been up countless nights before, before shows, you know, like uh, coding something and it's just not working. And there's this, you know, in, in the back of your mind that there's a 50% chance it's going to go wrong on the day. So you have to have contingency plans, you know. Do you want to tell us what your name is, please? Uh, yeah, Tom London. You spend a lot of your time in the States because mm -hmm. you've been a contestant on America's Got Talent. Yeah. Do you think there are differences in the way Americans compared to British people view technology? Oh yeah, entirely. Yes, definitely. How many millions of records do you think Mel, when she performed the Spice Girls, sold worldwide? For starters, in America everywhere you go there's a television screen. You know, every restaurant you go into, like, television's everywhere. I think Americans in general are taught to switch off a bit more when they see screens. Um, their mind kind of just diverts. So, so how does that affect your magic with them? Yeah, well that's the thing. My job is to try and direct their attention towards this technology and their subconscious is telling them to look away. I want you guys to see this. A bit more effort with Americans to be like, watch this. Just don't look away, watch it, and then like, we're good to go. I'm really keen to see a trick. Yeah? Is there anything you can do for us? Okay, here's what we'll do. Um, we're going to take a selfie together. Okay. But you have to copy me, so like this. Grab your phone and uh, hands like that. Yeah, yeah, and put, put the hand on your, that like that. Perfect. Okay. All right, here's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to draw a cross okay. on my thumb like this. Can you see that? I want you to watch the cross very carefully. Just stare at the cross. Yeah, yeah, I'm just going to pinch it like this. You see it go? Yeah. Unlock your phone. See, look, if you open up Twitter, I'm verified, so I should be at the top, but you'll see there's a photo <laughs> that I just tweeted of you. Oh, well, and look, oh can wow. Can you see? Show the camera. <gasps> You've got the cross in your hand, right? The cross is on my hand. But here's what's crazy. Look on the back of your hand, your left hand. <gasps> what? Oh, my goodness. That's really creepy. How did you make that happen? It's magic. Oh my goodness, look. <laughs> no idea, utterly mind-blowing.